minor, E7, and then A, and then we're going to add suspended, and E, and back to suspended. So those are the chords. Now what we're plucking during the chording is every other string. So we're going to start out 4, 2, 3, 1. There's four of those in the intro. starts the verse. So he actually starts the verse on the two. Okay, the verse is started. Now we go to a C, and the C is just going to be for two counts. So we're going to do five, three, four, two. All right. The rest will be kind of plucked through these middle strings. So we got C, one, two. Then we go to B minor, and we're going to do the same plucking pattern. But this is for uh, four counts. One, two, three. Then our E seventh for four counts. So go to your E seventh. Okay, we're just picking up our ring finger. And we're going to pluck six, three, four, two. Okay, same plucking pattern, just a different bass note. Four counts of those. Then our A. And the A will be five, three, four, two. Okay. And when we do the A the first time through, it'd be normal. All right. And then we're going to put our pinky down, so the last note that we pluck will be on the um, second string at the third fret. Then we go to the E string, so we're going to pluck five, three, four, one. So you have this so far. back to that third uh, fret second string okay that's for the verse now really the only time he does that is the first verse that sort of picking pattern um, when the second guitar comes in he might be doing some of that but um, if you're playing this out where we're on one guitar, we're going to start plucking. And that's what he does in the chorus. So the chorus will get us to the, what I consider the plucking part. This plucking part, we're going to be using our three fingers, um, first through ring, and just plucking three strings at a time. Okay? So the chorus, the chords are G, A, D, B minor. And then we repeat that. All right. Second half of the chorus changes a little bit. We're going to go G, A, D. Then we're going to go to C and B minor, B seventh, and A. Okay. So it changes it up a little bit the second half of the chorus. But the key to the chorus is the plucking. So we're going to hit our bass note. Got a G chord here. Hit the sixth string, and we're going to pluck the first through the third string. All right, next we're going to finger pick six, and then three and four. So we have this. And it's fairly quick. Okay, then you go to your A, and you're going to pluck the middle strings here. You're going to pluck two, three, and four be picking the same strings five three and four so we have this the 
again from the beginning. Okay, now we're going to do a D. So we're going to pluck the fourth root note, bottom three strings again. Now there's a walk down in this song. So you can use the walk down, the bass note, to be your um, walk down note. So we're going to have pluck the fourth string, pluck the first through the third, hit the C sharp, which will be with our pinky on the um, fifth string at the fourth fret, and then we're going to pluck two and three while we're holding that D shape. So. We go to our B minor and pluck the bottom three and then lift off so you got the A root note and pluck your second and third after the fifth. So all together the D should sound like this slowly. Then we're back to our G. For the second half of the chorus where they're doing the G, A, D, and then C, all right, what he has to do because the bass line doesn't walk to C, we're changing the chord, we're going to be doing an alternating bass plucking, okay, pluck and then finger pick. So for the G, do the G and the A stay the same? All right, now the D, what's going to change with the D is you're going to hit your fourth string, pluck one through three, all right? Then you're gonna hit your A and pluck two and then three, okay? So we're going to the alternate bass root, bass note in uh, the fifth string. So we have this, all right? Now we go to C, we're gonna pluck C and then pull up on the second, third, and fourth string. And we need our G note, okay? I usually use my pinky. I just put it down in this instant. And then we're going to pluck six and then three and four. So we have this. Okay, and then we're going to go to our B minor. Now you want to cover all the strings because your alternating note here is going to be that F sharp. So we're going to hit the B, okay, and pluck the second, third, and fourth. Then hit our F sharp and then the third and fourth. The timing's a little different here. Your um, B minor 7 and your E 7th are actually a half measure each. We're, we're shortening it up a little to the end of the uh, chorus. So, And then our E 7th. Now this is where you need to play the full chord because you're going to be using that B note on the 5th string. So we're plucking 6 and then 2 through 4 and then our B note and then second and third string so we have this and then our A changes let's hit the A root note pluck that and pluck two through four and then we're gonna pluck five and then three four and then there's a slight pause and then a walk up which is your A B and C sharp and then you're back into the chorus or the verse sorry so let's hear the A Now we're into the second verse, and the second verse changes things up because you have another guitar in there. So it sounds, it's either overdubbed or um, Jim Messina comes in. So you can finger pick through it just like you did the first verse, but the, there's another more dominant guitar thing, the plucking and then finger pick. Um, so it's the same idea, you know, we're just going to do the verse chords. So we've got D plucking on the one through four, then the A root note and then we're going to hit two and three. So it'll sound like this. Okay, so you can see how it changes a little bit there with the A. So what we're going to do there is hit our A root note, pluck second through four, and then we're just going to alternate the bass, the fifth string, with the second string. And we're going to move from the third fret. We're going to stretch it to the, this same note, 
open E, we're going to go to this E on the second string though. So it sounds like this. And then you got your walk up and start the second part of your verse. So the rest of the song, um, after some of that finger picking and plunking, he just plays the chords, or at least one of the guitars does. So you just hear him doing this. which, you know, strum sounds like this. everyone.